Okay guys, in this video, I wanna show you how to fix this weird issue if you have an Intel-based graphic integrated chip on your motherboard. So I see this happen a lot with the Intel Nooks, regular desktops, if they have the Intel integrated graphics on that board, then you might run into this issue with Google Chrome. When you open up Google Chrome, everything at the top is black. Your bookmarks are gone, your minimize, maximize, close out thing is gone. You're like, you know, how do I close out of Chrome? And you have to force quit out of it, do all these things to get out of it. You reinstall Chrome, works for a little bit, but then it goes right back to displaying this big black screen at the front well hopefully this will be a fix for you so what you want to do is go into the intel graphics command center so if you don't have this you might have to install this on your computer but once you get it installed you should you need to find an area in the display area that's called scale and you want to change that to custom when it says maintain display scaling somehow that glitches chrome out and doesn't scale the uh, browser at maximize settings somehow so it you know some kind of weird glitch with chrome can't really explain because it it's a programming glitch. So like I said, change the scaling to custom and that should fix your issue. Different versions of the Intel graphics might show different things. Like here's an example of an older screenshot of that software. And this is in a different area called general settings. And then you go scaling, change it from full scale to maybe a center or maintain aspect ratio. It just depends on, you know, just play with it to see what works. Um, this won't change your screen resolution, but like I said, just change it to see what happens. This is another one that might look what you have see that scaling same thing the scaling thing and you can change it even to custom aspect ratio and just change it to 100 100 and for some reason that works so like i said this is what mine looked like this is i think the latest version so hopefully you know you have something like this another workaround is you do alt plus space and then select restore and it'll refresh the browser now it might work for a little bit but then again when you close out and reopen it might come back so this is the a big fix that i found that has worked for me and for other people and hopefully this helps you if you have any questions or suggestions please leave them below if you find another fix or anything please you know let everyone know in the comments below thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one